and I'm so happy to present to you uh, this gentleman that is working as a partner from one of our schools in the circle that I'm facilitating, and uh, is Dr. Uh, Andre Conada from Exaro. Yeah, last year I was uh, called in by my boss, and uh, <laughs> he showed me the Partners for Possibility uh, program and uh, asked me, do you want to participate? And I took all the papers from him and, you know, I always read, read the stuff. And then I went back to him the next day and said, yes, I would like to do it, but I will have to to get another two months in 20 in 2016, you know, two additional months of time to do it properly. But... Uh, <laughs> But so far, it's been worthwhile, I think. And just to see what has happened tonight, yo, you feel as small as this. If you sit amongst people, that make a huge difference. And I want to congratulate you all. And I want to thank you all. And I want to appreciate you all for what you are doing. My dad was a teacher, maths teacher of, of all, so I grew up in the house of a teacher, and it was always amazing for me, you know, that kids that he taught came back after years, you know, big guys with boopings, uh, and you know, with kids, etc. And they always came back to him and just thank him for that spanking, you know, at that specific time, that, that made a difference to their lives. And that's what teaching is about. You know, you make difference to the lives of, 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 of the kids. And Exaro got, got involved in, in this through the Exaro Achievements Fund. And I must say you, this is not Exaro's money. This is money that we collect, if I can say it like that, from the companies that we do business with. So part of the business with Exaro is put away in a fund, and this is what is funding this, this, this program. We do believe that we need to invest in education. I was fortunate to be part of a, of a program over, the, over this last few months where we looked at what will Exaro be in 2026. And one of the pillars will be education. So we will, in 2026, we see ourselves actively investing in education. We see ourselves not only as a minor, but also what do we do in the areas where we close the mine, where we sit with access water. So we will venture into agriculture. This is all dreams at this stage, but I do believe that it will become a possibility. The other thing is, what do we require in terms of skills in 2026? Trust me, and we had guys from all over the world, clever people. And there's a few basic things that will never change. One of them is proper leadership. The proper leadership principles, values. The core stuff, you know, that defines humanity, those things will never, ever change. So this is the things that we need to equip our children with. Because this is not a commodity, you know, that will end or will become uh, obsolete. So that's the one thing fundamental things that we need to invest invest in the other thing is that yes we will more and more live in a you know a connected world we we need special skills and that's why it is important that we do make the school a place where the kids want to spend their time in you know, simple stuff like mathematics 
a two liter coke bottle I've got a two liter coke bottle I've got ten guests how many coke can I give to each of my guests stuff like that 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 the kids can start to apply it in their daily daily lives this is the things that we need to need to focus on the other thing is what just amazed me about this this program and uh, that's that the community building event that we had we, we had more than 100 of our principals and partners together the passion the commitment of our Headmasters, wow, 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 wow. They are possibility. And this is what we need to exploit through this, this program. And the two legs of the Partners for Possibility program is the one, is the leadership that we need to assist our principals with. And the other one is to get the community involved. And that's why we as partners need to, to, to get involved. I just saw that a year is not enough. So please, partners, if you can, continue. Although there's not a formal program going on, please continue, because there will always be a need for the support. I want to leave you with a few thoughts. The one thing is that, you know, we realized in Exaro through this support for education, the return on investment beats the best projects that we invest in. That's the one thing. The other thing is, if you look at the principles and where they do, do operate, they do not have, have much, you know, and sometimes they do struggle. My message to you is, be the best that you can where you are. I'm going to say something in Afrikaans and then I'm going to, to repeat it in English. Blom waar jy geplant is. Flower where you are planted. Although nobody looks at that flowers, still flower, you will make a difference. You don't know when you will make that difference, but you will make that difference. So don't look at your circumstances and say, okay, no, this is an obstacle and that is an obstacle. There's still a few things that you can do. So that's why I say, be the best that you can. From my side, also a big thank you, um, Dr. Luis and the team, you know, for what you are, are doing, the difference that you are making, the possibilities that you are powering through this program as Exara, because our slogan is powering possibilities. We can also power possibilities in a very practical way. So, and I do share your dream to roll it out to each and every, every school. Is such a lot of goodwill. Let's exploit it and let's make the best for South Africa. Then, Christine and Dani, thank you for your passion and commitment to this to this program and also, you know, the way in which you, you spend the Exara Chairman's Fund money. And I just want to leave you with this thought. And somebody somewhere said, a candle loses nothing of its light by lighting another candle. Please go out there and light some more candles. Thank you. <laughs>